Hey guys, Big Swear at RoadToRuda.com. Morning Horn of Z's, kind of your morning. <laughs> on the road still, literally on the road, on the road again. A um, couple things, last night I, I downloaded the Addex white paper. Because Sean had mentioned Addex in one of his videos he was doing for another uh, smaller, much smaller ad uh, company. Uh, and he said, well, Addex has gone up so much. And I'm like, dude, Addex is the bomb. If you look at Addex and what they're gonna do with their technology and the people behind it and, and the full scope of fixing a $220 billion problem of advertising and advertising fraud, um, yeah, Addex is the bomb, absolutely. Read their white paper and read the people involved. And it's extremely complicated to uh, to do this right, to fix the online advertising industry. There's so much that has to go into it. You know, it's not just uh, posting ads for other people. They're, they're gonna verify ads, they're gonna have an exchange. There's uh, programmers, you know, world-renowned programmers working on it. It's gonna be a monster. And they're coming to market in, uh, at least their beta is, I think, uh, January of 2018. So get ready for that. Addex is gonna go moonshot. Um, it it will, literally will be, this is the kind of company we're looking for. We're looking for the Facebooks and the Googles and the uh, Apple computers and all that stuff that was kind of wallowing around back in the 90s and then just blossomed. These are the, the big monsters and Addex is absolutely gonna be the big monster in that $220 billion space. And the market cap right now is under $60 million. I think I think we could see a 10 bagger with Addex truthfully um, come you know in a few months. So <laughs> don't quote me on that. Don't quote me on that, but I would suggest that everybody read the white paper of Addex and you'll understand just how complicated and how how thorough they are going through this stuff. They have advertising experts, they got programming experts. Um, they're gonna focus on the uh, you know YouTube type of stuff, digital advertising, uh, movie advertising, things like that. And I mean, <laughs> you read through the people who are involved and it's some of the biggest names you've heard of in the crypto space, in the advertising space. So I'm very excited about that one. I uh, also listened to Jay Snips 4's video this morning on, he's buying an RV, little sucker. Uh, I've been talking about an RV for I can't tell you how long, and I haven't pulled the trigger yet because when I do pull the trigger, I want I want it. It's a pretty sweet RV. I want something that's completely off-grid, completely uh, four-wheel drive type of, uh, you know, I want the bomb. If I'm gonna, if I'm gonna do that, spend some time in a, in a uh, traveling house, I absolutely want to get uh, something nice, something cool, something that's comfortable to live in um, and is completely off grid. Uh, so you can, you know, just put your, uh, park your, your RV and live off the solar panels for a good two or three weeks to months. And, um, and they make them. They're very expensive, the good ones. But, uh, you know, if the cryptos keep going well, that's gonna be my treat. One day I'm gonna post a video and say, I got the coolest RV you ever saw in your life. It's gonna be four wheel drive, off grid, all the bells and whistles, completely Wi-Fi enabled, satellite, you name it. You name it, I'm gonna have it. <laughs> but I'm gonna wait. Uh, Jason Four is getting, he already bought one. He got a fortune cookie that said, your life, you're about to go on an adventure. And, and he went out and he bought an RV because the uh, salesman was, his uh, his cubicle in his office was Adventure Lane. And Joe's like, synchronicity, there we go. Gonna happen. If you ever saw the movie Joe versus the Volcano, I, that's what I keep imagining, Jason Step 4 going in there. I'm going on an adventure, a real adventure. Ah, oh, so funny. But I'm proud, proud of Joe for all he does for the crypto people. Um, I'm proud that he, he really does stand up for what he says. He's gonna stand up for it when he screws up like we all do. 
Uh, he's the first one to jump up and say, I'm going to help as much as I can to, to make this right, and he does it. And that's the kind of people the, the Earth planet Earth needs, in my opinion. Um, so, yeah, I'm very happy for him. And he's, he's, got, you know, he's got a new house. He's going to park his RV right by his crypto cave. And he's loving life, and, uh, and he deserves it. He's made the right decisions for the most part over the past three or four years um, in the cryptos. And yes, I think he made the right decision with this silver. It's just, you know, he's, he's a man way before his time. <laughs> silver will have its day. Um, I don't know when. But in the meantime, you're going to need cryptos. So get out there and, and buy, buy, buy. I, I'm getting a lot of emails from people saying, okay, okay, fine. You wore me down. I'm going to get into the cryptos. How do I do it? Uh, unfortunately, I don't offer that kind of... I have a consulting service, a one-hour phone conversation um, that I can, I can walk you through it, but truthfully, the liability of teaching someone how to do the cryptos without them learning for themselves is, is not something I want to take. I can't buy cryptos for people because um, the, the laws around whether or not you're a money... Uh, uh, I forgot the license number. You need a license to to handle other people's money, that type of thing. And I'm way too visible in the crypto space and the silver space to to buy cryptos for people, so I don't do that either. Um, so I can't help you out. But you can go to YouTube and find out any information you want. You can learn this stuff by yourself, which I did. I learned it all by myself. And you can do that too. You just gotta put the time and effort in. And if you want, if, if, if now is the time you're saying, oh, I, I really want to uh, get in this crypto thing, you better spend some time to learn it and you'll learn how to buy it and you learn how to sell it and you learn what's good and what's bad. And you can find all that information out on the internet, on YouTube videos or on, uh, you can read books on it. I've done it all. I've read everything I could and, and you know, spent the time. And so those of you saying, Pix, just, can't you just buy it for me and give me it? <laughs> no, it's, it's one of those things you can, uh, you can give a man a fish or you can teach him how to fish. You give a man a fish, he, he feeds himself for a day. You teach him how to fish, he feeds himself for a lifetime. So you gotta go out there and, and <laughs> learn how to fish in the cryptos. And it's all up to you. If you don't know something crypto related or do you have a question crypto related, go on YouTube and ask the question in the search function and you're gonna find an answer, I guarantee you. Or read some books, amazing books out about the, you know, everything about the beginning of cryptos and why they're so good. Understand that it's gonna be a wild ride. The volatility is there because there is no regulation really. But the regulation is coming and I think it's a good thing for the most part. Also, um, I think at some point down the line in the very near future, the laws that will be placed about hacking, about stealing Bitcoin, about computer uh, Bitcoin theft, crypto theft, uh, anything detrimental to the, the crypto economy, the laws will be monstrous. As in 50 years in jail if you try to hack somebody's crypto out of their wallet. Because that's how important it is. If we truly do need a different form of money, which everybody pretty much agrees, um, we're gonna have to protect that money. And there are a lot of people who are right now throwing up Ponzi schemes like BitConnect and USI Tech, complete Ponzi schemes. And it's easy to tell a Ponzi scheme, just run a, a simple uh, compound daily calculator on 1% per day that BitConnect says they give out. And within five to 10 years, you own every single asset on planet Earth if you compound that interest daily. Uh, Cliff did the math on this. He thinks it's gonna implode right around December 8th through December 10th. Um, I, I don't think it matters because come January, uh, BitConnect Limited, which is the official um, license, supposedly, the business license for BitConnect, um, they didn't file their one year, because they're a Ponzi scheme, they didn't file their one year paperwork um, so they have two months to correct that. I think it's till January 8th, 2018, if it is not corrected and 
and whoever the, the mystery owner is of Big Connect comes out of the closet and, and claim, you know, claims the company is automatically taken over by the, uh, by the crown, the Queen of England, then owns BitConnect and all of the accounts within BitConnect. So, um, some people sent me a, a new business that uh, jumped up called BitConnect International. And it has a board of directors even, as, whereas BitConnect Limited didn't. Um, that is not BitConnect. That is a group of some of the highest participants in the Ponzi scheme that got together and said, oh, we're an investment management company. It even says that in the filing. We're an investment management company. So they're trying, I don't know if they're the ones claiming that uh, they are owners of BitConnect or it's just the BitConnect people saying, look, see, there's another company that jumped up. Completely different companies, completely different ownership. Uh, the ownership of BitConnect is is kind of uh, unknown right now because the the person who created it and the person who has taken all the Bitcoin out of that system it wants to be far, far away from it when it explodes, which is coming up in the next few uh, weeks and months. So do not, whatever you do, invest in BitConnect or any of the other Ponzi schemes. If it's too good to be true, it is. if it sounds too good to be true, it is too good to be true in the crypto world. You have to know who the people are dealing with uh, the technology, dealing with the company, and don't believe anybody who says, I have a magic trading bot that makes more money than anybody. Because they don't, absolutely don't. But they can give out earnings pretending that they have this magic trading bot and pretending for a while as the Ponzi scheme grows by paying off the first investors with the new investors' money. Uh, definition, that's a definition of a Ponzi, and that's exactly what's going on at BitConnect. And I, get, I suspect US, USI Tech, and there's about 20 others. And remember, there's very few regulations out there in the crypto world, so be careful, be safe, be smart. Um, you don't need you don't need to get rich quick. You can get rich quick by buying Litecoin right now before the end of the year. It's like sixty five bucks right now. Will it go triple digits by the end of the year? Absolutely, I think it will. And that's a huge gain, a legitimate gain, also. So uh, stay tuned for that. Stay out of the the criminal aspect of uh, the blockchain and the. And uh, everybody congratulate Jay Snip for on his RV and he's ready for his adventure. Just like Joe versus the volcano. Go check out that movie. BigSquareRoadRoader.com. Talk to you later.